Hello and welcome to Living Supernaturally. We're doing a very interesting series called Daily Reminders. I'm sure you have a to-do list as you start work. Uh, maybe you have a checklist for things to buy if you go to the grocer, um, grocery shop. And uh, maybe as a student, you have a checklist for things to study and finish, assignments to complete um, uh, for you know today and for the days ahead. Um, how wonderful it would be if we have a similar a checklist, a daily reminder of the eternal truth of who God is to us and who we are to Him. A reminder of these powerful truths so that we don't forget. The psalmist says in Psalm 103 and verse 2, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and forget not all His benefits. So he is reminding himself. He's saying, forget not. Remember. Choose to remember. So today, our daily reminder uh, is this foundational truth that God dwells in us. Just think about it for a minute. Let that sink in. This God of heaven and earth, He dwells in you. He dwells in me. Provided we have invited Him as Lord and Savior into our lives. Now that's the thing. If we have invited Him, invited the Lord Jesus into our lives as our Lord and Savior, He dwells, He comes, and He makes His dwelling place in us. This is what uh, the Lord Jesus said in John chapter 14 and verse 23. Jesus answered and said to him, If anyone loves me, he will keep my word, and my Father will love him, and we will come to him and make a home with him. How wonderful! Um, to, to know that our God comes and makes His home, His dwelling places, abode in us frail human beings. John chapter 14 and verse 15 to 17, If you love me, keep my command, commandments, and I will pray the Father, and He will give you another helper, that He may abide with you forever. The Spirit of truth, whom the world cannot receive, because it neither sees Him, nor knows Him, but you know Him, for He dwells with you and will be in you. It's talking about the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of Truth, the Spirit of Revelation and Wisdom, the Spirit of Power, Spirit of the Power, Fear of the Lord. This wonderful Holy Spirit, He will be with us forever. He comes to make His dwelling place with us and He is in us. Not only does He dwell with us, but He dwell in us, but He empowers us. He reminds us of the things that the Lord Jesus has taught. He enables us. He empowers us to live a life of holiness. He, he changes us from the inside out to be like Jesus. So we have this wonderful privilege of God dwelling in us. We are never alone. We have the privilege of hearing His voice. We have the privilege of being led by Him. And we have the privilege of leaning on His understanding and wisdom. And we have the privilege of having a daily, a moment by moment conversation and communion with this awesome God. What an awesome privilege. Shall we thank God today and be reminded of this uh, amazing truth? Let's pray. Father, we thank you for this daily reminder, God, that you indwell us. The God of heaven and earth indwells us today. Lord, we thank you that you choose to indwell us. And Lord, we choose to open our hearts, open our lives, for you to speak to us, minister to us, lead us, guide us, provide your wisdom and understanding to us, and all the wonderful things that you want to release in us and through us. Lord, so we open our hearts, Lord. We open our lives, Lord, and we say, come, have your way in us. We thank you for this reminder. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.